Epilepsy can be simply defined as a tendency to have recurring seizures which originate in the brain. A seizure is a brief and temporary malfunction of normal brain activity. By brief, we mean the malfunction can in some cases only last for seconds, and temporary means that the brain activity returns to normal after the seizure. A seizure is often compared to a computer crashing. To expand on this, I'd like to explain a little about how your brain is structured. The human brain is the most complex organ known to man. It contra controls all bodily function, movement, sensory perception, memory, mood, information and speech processing, and has often been described as a biocomputer. The brain is made up of about 100 billion neurons or nerve cells. It would take you 3,171 years to count them all individually. These neurons communicate with each other through electrochemical messages, rather like brief sparks, which travel at speeds of up to 268 miles an hour. In simple terms, an epileptic seizure, or the temporary malfunction, occurs when these messages get mixed up. The area of the brain where the malfunction occurs, and the pattern of spread, determines the different seizure types. This will be explained further in the video, What are Seizures? Epilepsy is the most common serious neurological condi condition affecting 50 million people worldwide. A recent prevalence study undertaken by Brainwave has shown that in Ireland, at least one in every 115 people has some form of epilepsy. That's about 37,000 people over the age of five. The significance of having epilepsy will vary from person to person. For many people, it will only affect them for a short period in their lives. For others, however, the consequences can be more long-lasting and can lead to significant disability, impaired social and psychological functioning, and in some cases, even stigma and discrimination. In most cases, epilepsy is treated with medication. Over the past few decades, new drugs for epilepsy have become available, which allow many people with epilepsy to live virtually seizure-free lives and with a good quality of life. Research into the condition is ongoing, both in Ireland and internationally, to continue seek, to seek out new and better ways of managing epilepsy and hopefully to one day find a cure. Epilepsy knows no boundaries. Anyone of any age can develop the condition. It pays to be seizure aware. Thank you.